Hey there, everybody. Welcome back. We are doing 2.1 still. This is extra C. Uh, and this is word problems for that have equations. And we're going to start off returning to stuff we did before, the percentage problems. So if I take a look at 72, 52%, that should say of 95 is what? This is like my is of percent triangle. The what is our is, it's an X. And then usually the way we do these is if you want to do them as an equation, percent times base equals amount. And the base is the bigger amount, usually. So in this case, 52% is 0.52. of 95, my base is 95, is what? So that's kind of like what we had before, just using the is a percent triangle. Question mark up top, 95 and 0.52 here. Forty-nine point four. We can switch that a little, bounce around a little bit, where we have a different one. Like, let's do eighty. One is zero point two five percent of what? So that's my percent. What is the base or of goes with base. And that means my amount is my is. So 0 0.25 as a decimal. Remember, we got to move it left twice. What? I don't know. But A, I'm just filling these in. <coughs> So to divide by 0 0.0025 on both sides. Four hundred. That's the kind of I things you're working with there with percent and base. Uh, another way of doing the is a percent thing. Let's take a look at number 88. This is related to stuff you guys might care about. If Tim gets 27 problems correct on a test, What is Tim's percent correct? This is on a test with 45 problems. This is actually the is a percent thing again. We don't know the percent. What he has is 27 out of 45. So 
So out of 45 problems, he got 27 correct. Our base is the bigger number, almost always, unless you end up with over 100%. So P times B equals A. My A must be my 27 because that's my B. I don't know P. P times 45 equals 27. I will divide both sides by 45 to get B, P by itself. Three over five is 0 0.6. Buddy, we wanted a percent. So we move it right twice. And we get 60%. <clears throat> okay. Let's do a sales problem. Ninety-eight. There's a golf shop that marks up. Uses a markup rate of forty-five percent on a set of tour pro golf clubs. That costs the shop $210. What is the selling price? Okay. So the way that sales work is you have <clears throat> the, the cost price plus markup equals sales price. So what is the markup? We know cost price, that's 210. I don't know that, and I don't know that. So let's figure out the markup first. The markup or profit is going to be a P times B equals A. It's a percentage of the base amount. 45% of the base amount is going to be our markup or our A. Ninety four point five, and that's dollars. So I can put that up here, and we'll see that the sales price is two ten plus ninety four point five, or ninety four dollars and fifty cents, and that gets us three hundred and four dollars and fifty cents. Another way of doing this all is one step is saying that the sales price equals the cost plus percent. 
times cost. The markup percent times cost. 210 plus 0 0.45 times 210. If I do that in a calculator, I have an extra decimal place there. Three hundred four point five. Okay. Uh, something else, uh, like where we have a sales price. Uh, let's see the the lube place near my my house for cars is called TNT Quick Lube. TNT Quick Lube. Uh, let's say they offer offers fifteen percent off an oil change. They, it would always be something like fifty nine ninety nine or something with the ninety nine cents, but I'm just going to round it to sixty dollars. That's about the price of an oil change uh, for for good oil. How much do I save? And what is the new price? So this has a similar formula. It's sales price equals original price minus discount. So I want to know part A, what is my discount? And then part B, what is the new price? So the discount is 15% of $60. That's going to be some amount. that nine dollars nine dollars so I'm gonna save nine dollars which means the sale price or what I have to pay is the original minus the discount which is fifty one dollars so fifty one dollars for my oil change. I don't think TNT does 15%. I just think they do a flat $4 or something like that. But that's the kind of idea of what we're working on here. Uh, and the way that percent thing shows up in a lot of stuff in life. It's not just stupid made up problems, but like things related to sales and profit and all sorts of stuff. All right. Peace.